Reading Srimad Bhagavatam, Canto 4, Chapter 21, Instructions by Maharaj Prithu, Text Number 10. Convasya kritim no srenoti apik no. Convasya kritim no srenoti apik no. Yad vikramo chistam mashesha bupa. Yad vikramo chistam mashesha bupa. Loka sapala upajivanti kamam. Loka sapala upajivanti kamam. Adhyapitan. Adhyapitan me vada karma shudham. Adhyapitan me vada karma shudham. Kanvashya kirtim na shrenoti apikno. Kanvashya kirtim na shrenoti apikno. 
是有智慧的。Yet, yet, his, 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 Vikrama, Vikrama, Shivori, Shivori, 勇士。Which is the remnant, remnant, 剩余的。Ashesha, Ashesha, innumerable, innumerable, 无数的。Gopa, Gopa, king, king, 国王们。Loka, Loka, planet, planet, 星球。Sapala, Sapala, with the demigods, with the demigods, 和他们的伴随人。Upachivanti, Upachivanti, oh, to the sun. Execute livelihood. Execute livelihood. Kama, Kama, desired object. Desired object. 想要的物体。Adya api, Adya api, up to that. Up to that. 直到。Tat, tat, that, that, me, me, unto me, unto me, to me, vada, vada, please speak, please speak, please speak, karma, karma, activity, activity, 活动，活动，should have, should have, auspicious, auspicious, 吉祥的， translation, Prithu Maharaj was so great. In his activities and magnanimous in his method of ruling, that all the kings and demigods on the various planets still follow in his footsteps. Who is there who will not try to hear about his glorious activities? I wish to hear more and more about Prithu Maharaj. Because his activities are so pious and auspicious. 译文：昆图国王的活动如此非凡，其统治方式充分体现了他的宽宏大量，以致所有的国王和各个星球上的伴随人至今仍在效仿他。有谁会不想聆听有关他光荣的活动啊？我期望更多的聆听有关昆图国王的一切，因为他的活动是那么的虔诚和吉祥。Purport by Shri Prabhupada. Saint Vidura's purpose in hearing about Prithu Maharaj over and over again was to set an example for ordinary kings and executive heads who should all be inclined to hear repeatedly about Prithu Maharaj's activities in order to also be able to rule over their kingdoms or states very faithfully for the peace and prosperity of the people in general. Unfortunately, at the present moment, no one cares to hear about Prithu Maharaj or to follow in his footsteps. Therefore, no nation in the world is either happy or progressive in spiritual understanding, although that is the sole aim and objective of human life. 圣人维多拉之所以想要一遍又一遍地聆听关于昆图国王的一切，是想要为普遍的君主和执政首脑们树立榜样。让他们知道，他们都应该想要再听、再三的聆听 Prithu 国王的活动，以使自己能够为人民大众的和平与繁荣、忠实、正确的管理他们的王国或国家。不幸的是，如今没人想要聆听有关 Prithu 国王的一切，或呃同他学习。因此，世上没有一个国家的人民是幸福的，或在灵性上正在取得进步，尽管那是人类生活的唯一目标。Om Magyana Timarandasya Gyananjana Shalakaya Chaktur Militam Nena Tasmai Shri Gurave Namaha Panchakalpatarupyasya Kripa Sindhu Vayabacha Patita Nam Pahanibyo Vaishnavibyo Namo Namaha 
Jai Shri Krishna Chaitanya Prabhu Nityananda Shri Advaita Gadadha Shri Vasati Gaur Bhakta Vrinda Hare Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Rama Hare Rama 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 Hare Hare So the, the activities of Maharaj Prithu brought so much pleasure to Vidura in hearing about his wonderful activities, he desired to hear again and again, to hear more and more. And by hearing about the activities of a great soul like Maharaj Prithu, then we understand what should be the proper behavior, what should be the proper actions for those people following the, in the footsteps of Maharaj Prithu. From the Bhagavad Gita we learn that it's the nature of the the leaders of society, that they set the standards for others. In the Bhagavad Gita, it's Yadyara Charati Shrestastata Devi Tarojana Sayapramanam Kurute Lokastad Anuvartate Whatever actions, whatever standards are set by the leaders of society, other people will follow their example. The whole marketing industry, the whole advertising industry is all based on this principle. And we see and someone, someone is a big name, maybe as a, a sportsman or as a movie star. So they, they will be used to promote uh, products and uh, people will see that they're using this product, they will want to follow their income. Somebody is a football player and they wear the, they wear this shoe, you know, and then they, they say this shoe that he scores a lot of goals with this shoe, you know. And so people will think I will also buy this shoe, I will also be able to play football like this man. So you get other famous movie stars, they use this soap for their body or the shampoo for their hair. And other people they want, oh this is this is good, I will use this. We are influenced by the standards set by the leaders of the society. So the problem is in the Kali Yuga, those people who are the leaders are the most corrupt, the most sinful, the most degraded people. And, and blind people, foolish people will follow these people. Srimad Bhagavatam describes people who are like hawks and dogs and camels and asses. They will, they will pick the biggest hog, dog, camel, and ass as their leader. Mm, Somebody is a big hog, a big pig, but they will praise another big pig for their leader. 
呃，如果一个人是一个猪的话，他就会去赞扬另外一个呃猪的像猪一样的统治者。But, but in the past, the leaders of the society in the past they were great souls. They were mahajans. They were wonderful, powerful personalities of the highest character. 呃，但是在过去呢，统治者他们其实是伟大的灵魂，他们被称为马哈赞的，呃，他们是很崇高的人物。They had the highest qualities, and they had they 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 set the highest standards of behavior for others. 呃，他们通常具有最好的品质，因此他们建立的榜样，呃，他们的这个水准也是最高的。We were we were talking in previous days about Maharaj Pritu. How he was a very good example for everyone, and everything he did, he was very caring for everyone. And he didn't, and he was not proud himself. 呃，之前我们也讲过了，马哈拉什·昆图，他的活动、他的行为非常的伟大。呃，他并且并不傲慢，他在乎和关怀每一个人。He was a a gentle soul with noble character. 呃，他是一个很温柔的灵魂，他关心每一个人。And the, there were many, many great kings who all had similar qualities, and he, they set the highest standards by their own example. 呃，其他的很多的国王，他们也是如此，具有最高最高的品质。呃，所以他们以自己为榜样，他们树立的这个水准也是最高的。So in this Mahabharata, it is stated how. You should follow in the footsteps of the Mahajans. Mahajano yena gata sapanta. Follow in the footsteps of the great souls. Mahabharata 就说我们要追随那些伟大的灵魂的脚步。The Mahatatvam nitam guhaya Mahajano yena gata sapanta. You want to understand the absolute truth. The absolute truth is hidden in the hearts of the pure devotees, and you have to follow in the footsteps of these pure devotees, and then they can reveal everything to you. 如果我们想要去了解绝对的真理，这个绝对的真理是装在那些纯粹的奉献者的心中，因此我们要去服务和追随纯粹的奉献者的脚步。The problem is that in the Kali Yuga, people don't have that intelligence to know who to follow, and they will follow blind people. Uh, 问题是在卡利年代，这个年代的人并没有智慧，他们不知道自己应该去追随谁，因此他们通常非常盲目的追随那些不该追随的人。It is said the blind will follow the blind. So if a blind person tries to lead other people. Then you cannot expect to get any good destination. Ah, we will say a blind person will follow another blind person's path. But if a blind person is the leader, he will lead everyone to the dark places of darkness. Somebody is blind. They're going to fall into the ditch. They're going to go off the main road. They won't know where they're going. If a blind person is blind, 呃，眼睛失明的，他就会走到小路上去，呃，脱离了正轨，走上偏道。So in the Kali Yuga, this is the situation that the leaders, the so-called leaders of society, are basically blind people who don't have the clear vision to know which way to go. 卡利年代的情况就是这样子的，这里的统治者，他们就像双目失明的人，自己并不知道要去到什么方向。But we have selected them as our leaders. And we're following them blindly. Uh, 但是我们自己选取了选取了这些统治者，然后非常盲目的跟随着他们。So how can you expect to get any good result? You cannot expect to get any good result. 呃，这样的话，我们又怎么能去期待好的结果呢？嗯，这是不可能的。So people need to hear about great saintly personalities like Maharaj Pritu. 所以人们要去聆听那些伟大的人格，关于他们的事迹，好、呃、像是 Pritu 国王。But today, who do we hear about? We hear about movie stars and sportsmen and all people who have actually no real good character. 但是我们现在会聆听谁的故事呢？我们听的更多是电影明星呀、啊，呃，然后运动员呢、啊，运动明星他们的事迹，呃，但是这些人他们的人格并没有那么崇高。Srila Prabhupada at one point, uh, he 
was going to meet Indira Gandhi. Indira Gandhi at that time, she was the Prime Minister of India and Srila Prabhupada was uh, introducing Krishna consciousness to the people of India and, and Indira Gandhi wanted to meet Prabhupada. Uh, Prabhupada那时候他见到了Gandhi uh, so Prabhupada had a few points which he wanted to make to Indira Gandhi. One of them was that he wanted everyone in the parliament, they should be a twice-initiated Brahmana. And they should all be strictly following the four regulatory principles. But if people are elected into positions of leadership and they have uncontrolled senses, they eat everything, and they drink all kinds of things as well, then you cannot expect to get any good character from them. You cannot expect to get any good results from them. During Srila Prabhupada's time, one of Srila Prabhupada's disciples, a devotee named Balavanta Prabhu, he was the uh, temple president of Atlanta. And we had a temple, we have a temple in Atlanta City there in USA, and he was the temple president. He was actually the son of a lawyer, and he was a very good talker. And so he, he actually went, did try to do some politics. He entered into a political campaign. So, uh, you know, to go in politics in USA costs a lot of money, and so Prabhupada didn't encourage it. When he heard how it's going to cost so much money, he said, forget it, you know, <laughs> you don't want to waste their money in that. But for some time, Balavanta was engaged in the political campaign, and he would be invited onto television programs where he would sit with the other political candidates, and they would discuss together. So he would always argue to them that it's very important that if any if we're going to represent the people that we have to control our own mind and senses. We have to be people of good character ourselves. And if you cannot control your mind and senses, then you're not qualified to represent the people. And in this way, Balavanta Prabhu was preaching to them that everyone you, you have to accept that if you're going to control your mind and senses, you have to give up intoxication and gambling and illicit sex and these things, these are all very against all principles of uh, society. And the people, the other politicians, they would agree, they would say, yeah, you, we agree, we agree that you're right. And of course, they, 
They, they externally they agreed, but at the same time they could not follow these principles themselves. 实际上，他们只是表面上说说而已，内心内在的他们其实做不到。But still, externally, verbally, and on because they're on television in front of the mass of people, they they had to agree that what this man is saying is true. That cleanliness, mercy, austerity, truthfulness—these are very important principles. 嗯、uh, ，因为当时大家都在电视上，所以他们表面上。嗯、uh, ，就说啊，是这样子的，是对的，你是对的。像是一些好的品质，比如说清洁啊、呃、诚信、苦行、仁慈啊、呃，这些我们都应该做的。And if one is not following these principles, then he is not a worthy person. He's not a person of any good character. 呃，如果一个人不能做到这些品质，不能遵循这些原则，呃，他不是一个很好的人，他的他的品格并不高尚。嗯。The, the the people in general want to trust a leader. They look up to a leader and they expect to see exa- a, a good example from him. But if a person will be uh, uncontrolled in their eating habits and drinking. Then we cannot expect to, that this person has any good quality. 嗯，但是如果一个人他有很多不受控制的行为，比如说啊，他什么都吃，然后他会酗酒的话，那我们不能期待这个人有崇高的品格。嗯 ，their their character will be doubtful because they don't have control over their own tongue. 呃，因他们的人格，他们的品格是受到怀疑的，因为不能控制自己的舌头。So people were often shocked when they hear about the immoral lives of some of the leading politicians in the world or in their country. So, 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 人们想要看到好的榜样，但是在卡利年代，这个很稀有。Even if you look at the so-called heads of religious churches, that they eat everything and they drink everything. 呃，如果我们看那些教堂的领导者，有的时候他们也什么都吃，什么都喝。They want to talk. They try to preach about God, but they have no standards in controlling their own senses. 他们想要去传播关于神的信息，但是他们自己啊，并没有任何的标准啊，呃，要去要求自己，他们什么都吃。The they have、uh, in the Catholic Church, for example, they have、uh, they 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 have priesthood, and the priests、uh, they may they they have to make a vow of celibacy. 呃，在这个基督教的教会当中。呃，有的时候牧师他需要做出一个宣誓，我要保持真守。But at the same time, they're eating all kinds of non-vegetarian food, and they're accustomed also to take alcohol. 呃，但同时呢，他们又会吃肉啊，然后也会喝酒。They have, and 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 naturally, because of these things, their minds will become very polluted, and they will become very disturbed. In their own spiritual practice. Because these actions, their own brains will become very disturbed. Ah, their own spiritual life will become very disturbed. They do not know the the principles of sense control. They have no understanding that they they want to practice celibacy, but at the same time they cannot control their own tongue. They take all kinds of food and drink. So how is it possible? It's not possible. 因为他们并不了解去控制感官的一些原则，他们想要遵守，但是同时却不控制自己的舌头，呃，会没有没有标准，什么都进食，呃，因此他们没有办法去做到很好的控制自己的感官。So Krishna conscious philosophy is teaching us how we can live a peaceful, happy life of sense control. 
。因此，回心脏知觉告诉我们如何能够通，如何通过控制感官，啊，我们过上一个非常快乐、平和的生活。We and we get our inspiration by hearing about the lives of great saintly persons like Maharaj Prithu. Ah, 那么我们这种精神的鼓舞来自哪里呢？来自于聆听关于伟大的人物，像是 Prithu 国王的事迹。It's important for us to hear from scriptures like Mahabharata, Ramayana, as well as Srimad Bhagavatam. They 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 tell tell us about the lives of great saints, the persons. 因此，聆听那些经典就非常的重要，像是啊，《Ramayana》、《马哈巴塔》和《圣贤菩萨瓦坛》，因为他们会给我们讲述那些伟大人物的事迹。But in the modern times, we don't have Kali Yuga. Ah, 在现代社会中，没有伟大人物的事迹。But in the modern times, Kali Yuga, people simply spend their time watching movies and listening to all kinds of glorifications of mundane personalities. How they, how they were, all, all, of all the, all the bad things which they did. But in the Kali era, everyone liked to hear about the ordinary people, such as some movie stars, and to listen to their evil deeds and bad things. You read about, you know, this this movie star and how they cheated and how they how they made so much money and how they took money from others. This different businessmen, how they got their money by lying and cheating. If they make a lot of money, they're considered a great success. Although they were liars and cheaters, and they deceived everyone. But because they made a lot of money, the whole world looked up at them and glorified them. Ah, we hear the stories. Usually, the movie stars or the rich people, ah, they are how they make their money, they make so much money. Ah, these people are considered very successful people, even though they make a lot of money. Sometimes they are very cruel, they are very evil. Ah, through cheating, they make a lot of money. Ah, through cheating, they make a lot of money. Ah, through cheating, they make a lot of money. Ah, through cheating, they make a lot of money. Ah, through cheating, they make a lot of money. Ah, through cheating, they make a lot of money. Ah, through cheating, they make a lot of money. Ah, through cheating, they make a lot of money. Ah, through cheating, they make a lot of money. Ah, through cheating, they make a lot of money. Ah, through cheating, they make a lot of money. Ah, through cheating, they make a lot of money. Ah, through cheating, they make a lot of money. Ah, through cheating, 在卡利年代，我们荣耀的人是错的人，我们并不知道啊，应该去荣耀哪些人。But in the past, people would hear about great saintly personalities. 但是在过去，人们会聆听伟大人物的事迹。And they would be inspired to follow their example. 他们会受到鼓舞，想要去效仿这些人。But in, nowadays. We don't want. We don't like to hear these examples. We don't want to follow the example of these persons. We want to follow all the very bad people, all the very degraded and corrupted people. We、we'll、follow them. We want to follow all the very bad people, all the very degraded and corrupted people. We follow them. This oh, this man he took the drugs when he was this age, and he he took the alcohol, and then he, he you know, and so many things they did, all the all the different things which they went through. Ah,、uh, 比如说有一个人，他可能年纪轻轻就染上了毒瘾，就吸毒啊， uh, 然后做了很多的坏事。我们通常听到的是罪恶的活动。And people think, oh, this is the real life. This is the life of a great leader. Ah, 人们就会想啊，这才是真正的生活，因为伟大的人物他们的生活是这样的。So we try to hear from pages like pages of the Shrimad Bhagavatam. We read about Maharaj Prithu. We want to become inspired that oh, Maharaj Prithu, although he's a king, he is a man of the highest character, greatest integrity. He didn't compromise. 嗯，所以我们要尽量的去听博萨瓦坛上的一些故事，比如说昆图国王的事迹。虽然他是一个国王，啊，他的他的人格非常的崇高，他不会在任何的层面做出妥协。Everyone else, they compromise when it comes to any kind of sense control. 呃，但其他的人，但谈，当我们谈到感官控制的时候，控制感官，呃，他们在这方面都会有一些妥协和让步。They don't see any purpose in controlling their senses. They think, oh, everybody eats meat, everybody drinks, so we should be just like everyone else. 呃，他们不了解我们为什么要去控制感官。呃，这些人会说，其他人也在吃肉，也在喝酒，所以我也这样子。
如果这个世界都下地狱的话，那我们就一起去吧。嗯。So，yeah，that—that so any question? Oh, uh, mm -hmm. uh, uh, this uh, meat eating and uh, intoxication is uh, very common because uh, we hear that Jesus Christ shared wine mm -hmm. among the disciples and told them uh, you should take this. Uh, this is my blood. Is it true, Master? Um, Papa's question is that in the Jewish community, when they think that they will eat and drink, Papa will say, "Let us hear this story." Jesus gave his disciples wine to drink, and he said, "This is my blood." Well, you know, it's very common. Uh, people say that Jesus took three fish and fed the masses. 我们听到这个故事说，呃，耶稣他是拿了三只鱼给大众。But you have to understand, Lord Jesus was preaching in the desert, in a very, uh, uh, not very advanced civilization. 呃，但是我们要了解当时的情况，他是在沙漠里面传教，呃，当时的文明也不是很发展。If there is no food to eat, then they may have to eat. But he only had three fish, and with three fish he could feed the masses, the multitude. But the, the, these words which are used in the Christian Bible, like the word for fish or wine, now these are the translations of words which are not accurate. Is uh, actually in the Greek language what is called fish or wine, and it, it's not as we would understand it. Uh, you see, in the Old Testament, in the Old, there are two books in the Christian Bible. There's the Old Testament and the New Testament. So in the Old Testament, it's very clear that the diet for the people was vegetarian. And the Lord said, I, I have given you all the seed of the earth, and it shall be your food. So it was not that the people were killing. Rather, the Lord would go to the synagogue, he would let the animals go free, let the birds go free, put the fish back in the sea. He, he wouldn't encourage the killing of all these animals. So, Lord Jesus was not a meat eater, and there's there's a number of articles written by Christians about this. They say the Lord Jesus Christ was actually a vegetarian. But the common people, you know, today, people don't want to control their senses. And it used to say in the Christian Bible, thou shalt not kill. But then they changed it to thou shalt not commit murder. And um, in other words, you can kill animals, but you can't kill people. Uh, so there's been a lot of ed editing and going on in the, in the in the Bible, and they change things just to suit their needs. But you do have branches of Christians 
Christian tradition who are vegetarian. I'm just a branch of the Christian. There's a Seventh-day Adventist. They're vegetarian. Uh, Jehovah Witnesses, the vegetarian. Hmm. Yeah. Uh, I have a question, Maharaj. So yesterday during the initiation yagya, you said the yagya, the initiation ceremony, will take away some of the sinful activities people do. Uh, I want to ask why. Also, for people who are just watching the yagya, do they get benefited or purified? 我的问题是，马哈拉昨天在提一个火炬说，呃，这个仪式提的仪式会带走人们的一部分罪恶活动。呃，我想问马哈拉是为什么？然后那些围观的人，他们是否得到净化，得到好处？Yes, many activities we do can take away sinful activities. Just by Brahmiyatra, you see the jagannath on the chariot, and you can be a liberated soul by seeing the Lord on the chariot. Many activities we do can take away now that you're liberated, now that you're freed of sin, so now you should stop sin, no more sinful activities. As far as the fire sacrifice goes, the real purification in the section uh, is Sacrificial ceremony is the chanting of the holy name. In the Kali Yuga, the only real yagya which we can perform is the chanting of the holy name. The other, you know, the externally we're putting on a show, we're having a building a fire. And, Okay, so it, it, people like to see these things, but the real pur purification comes about by the chanting of the Holy Name. Uh, do people watching the Yagya get purified or benefited too? Well, it depends on them. You know, the real, as I said, the real benefit comes in the chanting of the holy name. So they hear the chanting of the holy names, they benefit. And they, if they chant the holy name, they'll get more benefit. Do they get any benefit to just sit and watch if there's no kirtan going on? Uh如果没有Kirtan的话,他们只是在那看着,他们会得到任何好处吗? No. 比如说泡泡说你抽烟你一天少抽一支一部件的可能一下子就不抽烟可以做不到所以我的问题是清除这个活动是不是分两种一下子完全彻底不做或者就按照注定的方式减少和多做什么 So Prabhu's question is some people might have a habit of doing simple activities um, So for, for these kind of people when they come to devotional service uh, there are two ways to stop doing simple activities. One is you just stop immediately. The second way is uh, can they do it gradually? Yes, well, yeah, it depends on the individual. Some people they will stop immediately and other people will take some time. It depends on how they how how they're affected by the 
chanting of the holy name but how they've heard the spiritual knowledge how much it's actually going to their heart <coughs> for some people they have to hear more and more just like we say you know a criminal somebody may be a thief and they get punished they get caught they put in jail and so that after they're punished one time they don't steal again but somebody else they steal they go to jail they come out they steal again they go back to prison again they didn't learn that stealing was wrong but the more intelligent person he simply heard in the beginning that it was wrong to steal and he never stole 有的人呢，他这一次被抓起来，他就不会再犯错；但是有的人放出来之后，他就会再去犯罪，又被抓进去。但是有的人，他通过聆听，他知道什么是不好的犯罪的活动，他就从来都不是做那些错的事情。So different people will be different. Some people they immediately understand about Krishna. Was born the whole life vegetarian, you know. There was no intoxication, no nothing like that. So when he met Bhakti Siddhanta Sarasati, you know, he'd already learned everything, he already knew these things, he wouldn't do these things. So you get people come to Krishna consciousness, they become you know, very pure from birth. And other people have had a lot of bad association with the material world. And takes longer time. Well, 嗯，他的妈妈好像在这方面对他并没有特别的一个关注教育，然后我就想问，像这样的孩子，他是前世带来的这种业报的反应呢，还是说他就是没有这种控制能力？那我们如何对这样的孩子进行这种呃自我控制
我说这个奉献者的母亲让他的儿子背一个思节我在讲这个思节我讲你十块钱你的人民币然后他问我我觉得他就说这个方法不是太好他也知道这个方法不好他就问有没有比这更好的方法来鼓励孩子做父母亲
，呃，他的母亲就会向他分享一些事情。这个小孩子，呃，他的接受度很高，他很愿意去接受。最后，他们把他送到了一个特殊的学校，然、呃、这个学校他是会用范文教授，从小就是教大家范文，啊、呃，然后会教他，呃，怎么去。这个学校建立者是 m a d a v a c h a r 的追随者，所以会教学生怎么去学习啊 m a d a v a c h a r 的一些教导，怎么去打败那些非人格主义者。So they have this kind of school, even today. You know, the, the, they have several hundred students there studying Sanskrit. After they graduate, then they can decide what they want to do. Some will become priests, some will become the pujaris in the temples, and some will be very few, maybe only go on to become preacher. 嗯，所以这个学校现在也是存在的这样子的学校。呃、嗯，那个学校可能有几百个学生，他们毕业之后，有的人可能会成为一个技师，有的人可能会，呃，也也很少的人会出去传教。嗯。啊。啊。Uh,
<laughs> then later, the, we will be giving all of your baby uh, ornaments. The baby today. Baby ornaments. Jewel. Maha. 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 Thank you very much. Hare Hare Krishna. Krishna. Hare 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 Krishna